everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here then hi, my name is Sophie and welcome to my space on the internet. In today's video we are doing something that I've never done before, I've never had a need to do this before. Um, we are doing my first ever homeware haul. Uh, bit of a disclaimer, I have not bought this all in one go. Not a chance, this has been like slowly accumulated since I found out that I was getting this flat and I was actually going to buy this flat. Um, I went to uni, um, if you didn't know, um, so I had like some like little bits of kitchen stuff from when I went to uni but not a full collection of stuff. Um, so I've slowly been accumulating this over the last couple of months. It's not, I'm not, I'm not finished, I'm not finished shopping, not by a long shot but I thought I'd do my very first ever homeware haul. So without further ado, let's get into this video. Now I don't really know where to start. Um, there's quite a bit of stuff that I've just slowly bought, like I've started to live in HomeSense. Any chance I can get to go to HomeSense, uh, then I am there. Um, oh yeah, I'm not wearing makeup right now because it is about 32 degrees. I am boiling. I've had to turn off my fan and close the window and I am already sweating. This is not okay. It is so hot. Uh, but yeah, that's why I'm not wearing makeup. I've literally just stuck my eyebrows down and put some mascara. Um, so yeah, let's pick something. Um, so first up, this is no way an essential, but in one of my many, many trips to HomeSense, I bought these marble coasters. Let's see if I can get it to focus on the coasters and not to my face. These marble coasters, like super thick and chunky. They were from HomeSense, I think they were £7.99. The brand is the Global Market Kitchen Collection. Um, handmade in India. They are super chunky and super nice. And um, there's lots of different shapes of these, uh, but I liked these square ones because they're quite chunky and nice. They were like circle ones and some square ones that were slightly thinner uh, but I got these ones uh, for a coffee table or whatever in my new flat. Coasters. <laughs> Next, this is like a practical thing that I don't own when I went to uni. Like, why would I? I wouldn't need to own this when I went to uni but like realistic life wise I'm gonna need a measuring jug so I got this Pyrex measuring jug which was £6.99 again I got it in HomeSense uh, but useful for measuring, making cakes, all sorts of things. Um, yeah, practical item. Next um, is in my opinion the most exciting item. I got so excited when I saw these and I am still searching for more of this brand in this colour every time I go into HomeSense Antique Game Max because it is such, like it's my colour scheme, it's yeah to show you. Um, it is the Le Creuset salt and pepper shakers but they're in like this cute little duckery light blue colour which is super cute which I'm guessing is like an old season collection because it's not like on the Le Creuset website anymore. Um, they were £9.99 for the salt and pepper shakers and I'm obsessed. Um, I really wanted the utensil holder but I literally can't find it anywhere. When I was in TK Maxx I had the like baby pink one but obviously I want the baby blue colour. I got these, £9.99, home sense again. Now, following on from that film, film? Following on from that um, salt and pepper shakers, I next found another Le Creuset item in the same colour scheme. Why I need this, I don't know. I've convinced myself that I'm going to make lots of um, lemon drizzle cakes and, you know, pancakes. I need to squeeze lemons for them, so... It was a practical choice. It was only £10 um, in the sale, but it was the Le Creuset Baby Blue um, lemon squeezery thing. But yeah, super exciting, super happy. Um, I literally obsessed with this like colour and this scheme. Like, you already can tell in my bedroom at the moment. <laughs> I haven't got a duvet cover on the bed. It's too hot. That's how hot it is. I haven't even got the duvet on the bed. Um, but yeah, I literally love like ducky blue, light blue. That's like my favourite colour and that is a major theme in every single thing that I've bought for my flat so far. So, get ready for that. <laughs> Next, following on from the blue theme. Um, again, I got this in Home Sense. It was, I think like £10. Uh, but it's a Joseph Joseph chopping board. It's one of the ones that like scoops up and you can put all your waste in the bin nice and easily. Um, again on my light blue theme super happy with it it's going to be useful i had chopping boards from uni but they were literally like half the size they were teeny tiny you could chop maybe one pepper on it and that was about it um and you still get stuff all over the countertop so happy to have like a normal size chopping board for my kitchen next um 
I actually got this in John Lewis and I wasn't really looking to buy anything when I went to John Lewis. I was just kind of browsing and seeing like what their homeware was like and seeing their Le Creuset section to see if I could get some more like blue Le Creuset. Uh, but obviously I can't because it's old season. Uh, but Tom actually pointed this out and he was like, oh, this is funny. And I was like, actually, they're super cute and I want that in my kitchen. Uh, but it is a like a hot plate for like a pan and it says, I'm hot, which is super cute. And um, just to, like keep next to the cooker. But yeah obsessed I'm hot <laughs> I can't remember how much it was I feel like it was like eight pounds I want to say I don't think it was too expensive because otherwise I would have had a heart attack and I'd remember that price um but yeah, I don't think it was too expensive next um I went to Bristol and saw my sister the other week and of course went to home since she's literally been working from home for a month so she hadn't like been out and about that much so I took her to home since to like the range like all over the place um in like a big shopping center in bristol um and i got a silicon wash brush to do all my washing up in the kitchen again it stick with my like bluey theme and it's also handy that it's like silicon so i wouldn't have to like change it as often as i did like a normal one so hopefully it's a little bit more sustainable to have a silicon one um next also from the same bristol shopping trip at uh, this time no that's from home sense yeah Still from, still from home since I got this marble peeler. I you see for the little arm. Super pretty blue marble peeler. I do think I have a peeler from uni, but I think it was one of like the really cheap IKEA ones, so I don't really know. I don't remember it working particularly well when I was at uni, so hopefully this one's gonna work better. And it's also aesthetically pleasing. Ooh. Next, <laughs> I got this set of utensils from HomeSense. Um, they're from the range, um, I got rid of the label, but it's like cook, cooking with colour, cook with colour. Um, the like, HomeSense has a ton of like, items from this brand, yeah, cook with colour. And you've got your like spatula, normal spoon, slotted spoon, spatula, and then draining spoon. I don't know, I've never really had one of these before, but they're all blue, they all match my theme, and they're like not the strongest. Like I've seen like sturdier and probably better quality like cooking utensils, but they're aesthetically pleasing and they go with the theme of my flat. So I bought them. <laughs> Next again from that was just a random trip to home sense i think one day when i was in town but this is from the bristol um trip to home sense i got this set of spatulas again i think this was from cooking with color um but it's two marble blue spatulas one big one small um for all your spatula needs literally i'm a sucker if something comes in blue then you know i'm gonna buy it i'm such a sucker but i'm happy it makes me happy so don't judge next okay i had no idea this was a thing like i've never seen this before but whenever i tell people and i'm super excited about it they're like yeah sophie that's been around forever um but it is a pasta scoop uh, if you know me i love pasta it's my go-to food like, if i don't know what to cook i'm literally just gonna have pasta and cheese and i was super excited when i saw this in waitrose and um, i'd just been to the dentist <laughs> i just had a filling and i was like when I was a kid, if we had like an injection or something, my mum would buy us like a present, like a Bratz doll or I think it was a Spice Girls doll, um, like as a treat. And as a joke, I was like, you know how I just had a feeling, like, you know you want to just get me a well done for being brave present. <laughs> I saw this spa pasta scoop and yeah, mum bought me a pasta scoop and I'm super happy about it. And no one else is excited with this, excited with this as I am. I don't know why, I've never seen this before in my life and I, I'm obsessed with pasta. But yeah, it's from Joseph and Joseph. I think it was like eight pounds maybe. I took all the labels off before I thought I should do a home haul haul and I've like taken off all the labels. So. Sorry, I can't be more accurate, but I can tell you where they're from. I just can't tell you exactly like the brand or some things. Um, next, this is again another home sense trip. I think I was just randomly in there one day after work as always and I got some reusable, um, silicon straws. It is. Everything I've been buying is from Cook With Colours. See this brand? 
cook with colour. Literally everything that I love from HomeSense is literally from this brand. Uh, but it's some long reusable silicone straws which I'm excited to use. Um, yeah, and it comes with a little cleaning brush as well. I thought it would be really handy to have like reusable straws. Because I like to use straws but I don't want to use plastic straws all the time and kill the ocean. Um, so yeah, reusable ones. Cool. Next. I did not plan on buying these, they just, we were in, where were we in, the range? No, Home Bargains, we are in Home Bargains, I think we are just getting like a toothbrush or something from Home Bar Bargains, um, and then I saw these balloon style gin glasses, which were like £2.99 for two, and they're massive, and they're going to be so good for drinking gin, and I'm super duper excited, but yeah, from there were like, Home bargains or something. £2.99. Bargains. I've got two sets, but I'm not gonna hold up and show you two sets. But yeah, I did get two lots. Um next. <laughs> I am literally so excited to get my flat, if you couldn't tell. Um these are some lampshades, which were from the range. Yeah. The range on our Bristol trip they were eight pounds each and in my living room I have two light fixtures and these are blue and cute and yeah I bought them for my living room and I'm super excited but yeah they were eight pounds each bargain we love a bargain next I mean it's not like an essential necessary for my new flat I just want all my coat hangers to be like the thin velvet ones so I bought these from HomeSense they were £7.99 they've got like the nice rose gold and they're like a nice grey is it like mar mild grey so I don't know I'll like see if you can see but they're a really nice colour of grey like all my coat hangers I think now fingers crossed are a version of these velvet where they're like pink blue grey they're some sort of version of this which makes everything so much easier like to fit on your wardrobe because they're so much thinner than like normal plastic ones so I love having them all like this and um, so I've got some spare ones from when I inevitably buy more clothes next another super duper exciting purchase I bought a chanel -y bath rug um, which is like a nice grey toned colour I don't have any pictures of the bathroom at the moment to show you um, but it's got like grey tiles um, so this is like a nice light grey but it's also got like a bit of a blue tint to it so it kind of like matches my bluey te like bluey theme for the rest of the flat so yeah super excited and it's not like not like a thick one because I know with like thick bath mats they're really hard to dry and then they get mouldy and gross whereas this is nice and thin um, and so should be good for my bathroom. Next I have a little knitted throw for the living room now this is actually sage green which is again is another colour that I do like in housing things um because I'm like a fan of old houses so like sage green is always like a really nice door colour with old houses and things like that um so yeah I do love a sage green so it's like knitted and then it's got these fluffy pom-poms on the bottom and this is going to be like for my sofa um in my flat and it was from Asda um George Home I think it was 20 pounds I think but yeah my sister bought it for me because she's the best um but yeah super duper cute and finally, everything that I've bought so far in this very first homeware haul. This next one, um, this is an idea in my head that I have. So in my kitchen currently, there's like two shelves near the window. But where obviously I've never had a house of my own, there's a lot of cupboard space in the kitchen. And I don't think I need the two like shelves of storage. So I'm going to take those down and put up this beautiful clock, which again is from... Home sense, you guessed it. Um, it was fif 15, yeah, 15 pounds. Um, super cute, duck egg blue clock. It's gonna go on the wall instead of those shelves because I don't need the shelves in the kitchen when I've got a massive cupboard space for someone who's never had a full kitchen to themselves. I don't need that much storage. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna put this up instead. Uh, it's more like my style uh, for the kitchen. Super exciting. Focus. Hi. So I realised after I filmed my uh, like collective homeware haul. I didn't actually show you the first things that I bought when I like realised that um, I was actually buying a flat, uh, mainly because they were upstairs in the attic of the garage. Because uh, I like, I like found out that I was 
buying a place I went and found my uni things to sort of discover what I did and didn't have from uni um so they were up here packed away um but I thought I'd come up here and show you as well might as well why is this thing not focusing anyway <laughs> first up is this drying rack um going along with my blue theme um this again from home sense and the price is rubbed off but i think it was like 10 pounds um but it's super cute and it's got like a little dish here for cutlery and then you've got your little plate racks but it's very me and very my aesthetics that was one of the first things that i bought why i don't know why that was the first thing i bought but it was um next i have some mason cash um ramekins they're like little pale blue ramekins um not that i'm going to be cooking like souffle or anything i'm literally got them for like nibbles and snacks like you put your chocolate raisins in there or your cheese bites and things um so yeah i got them again because they were my aesthetic i bought them um and then i think so lastly yeah lastly i bought some tea towels that were like a nice light blue creamy colors um but yeah they were the first things that i bought when i found out i was buying flat they were packed up here so i thought i'd come up here and show you um yeah back to the actual video so there we have it that was absolutely everything that i have bought so far um for my new flat i'm still waiting i have absolutely no idea when i'll actually move in like when i do eventually get the keys i don't think i'm going to move in straight away like i don't have a need to move in i can just live at home for a little bit and like clean the place paint the walls like do a little bit more and make it more homely before I just shove all my stuff in there um like I said everything that I have in my room is everything that I own so I don't have living room things that like I need to move in um I'm just gonna live at home for a little bit and then like slowly move in taking everything over definitely gonna leave a lot of stuff here because I have accumulated stuff i need to have a wardrobe clear out is that a video i want to see you want to see me clear out my wardrobe maybe who knows uh, this is my very first homeware haul i really hope you enjoyed it if you did make sure you give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel as well if i can i will try and link things down below but genuinely majority of it was from home sense and you know what it's like in home sense you can't always find it again but i like list them and like leave the brands that they are so you can try and find them yourselves uh, but yeah i really hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and have a lovely day